I think we're a really well-knit team. We get along really well and that really, we support each other, so really good for a good team vibe. Having a combination of older athletes and younger athletes, and I'm kind of in the middle myself, so it, uh, it creates a good team chemistry. Like, you get more experience helping out the younger guys, and the younger guys bring in a lot of lively energy to the older crew, so together you compete really well. Obviously amazing Glasgow four years ago. How have you changed as a gymnast from that guy who won the bronze medal on the floor to, to what we see now? Yeah, it's a completely different experience this time around. Um, I've changed a lot since then. Uh, my mind is kind of, uh, I guess, more matured in a way and uh, I'm much more relaxed this time around. Last time around it was, everything was a big deal. This time around I'm much more relaxed, which is, I think, a good thing. Yeah. Your sport is so unique. What do you think would surprise people if you told them you're a rhythmic gymnastics about some of the training and, and the work you put in? Some people think it's just like a whole bunch of ribbon dancing, <laughs> but it's definitely not. I think everyone's surprised when I tell them I train like over 36 hours a week. It's They're taken aback by that. <laughs> definitely a lot of excitement and pride for New Zealand representing my country. Uh, a little bit of nerves, but <laughs> mostly excited.